You might have heard about a psychic squid that predicts a World Cup winner or at least you have seen at the dinner table. The squid I am talking about is neither. This squid accidentally fell on us 100 years ahead of its time. This squid contribution to the medical field is invaluable. It revolutionizes the way you predict and diagnose diseases. This squid hunts cancer cells like you never seen before. It will pick up source of seizures in the brain like no other. It is just not picking the needle from a haystack. It can pick your lost nail from the Appalachian mountains. It does it all without sticking even a single needle. Does not even touch your body. Hold on, that's not it. It finds the oil wells without scratching the earth's plateau. It will read the terrorist minds of any evil plans. And heck, it will read your mind before you know it. That's right. It will predict your action before even you know it. Welcome to the world of a revolutionary psychic squid. If you... Hello, my name is Ramana Anamaraju. I have a passion for physics, specialized in LRD healthcare, and above all, concerned for well-being of all humanity. Edward Flynn was hit by tragedy twice and lost both of his wives to breast cancer. When his first wife was fell in coma, he used to visit her at the hospital. He used to whisper in her ears, wondering she may be understanding what he was saying. After a few months, she died. Not knowing his wife understood his undying love for her or not is frustrating. Then second wife, after a brief marriage, lost to breast cancer again. He is determined to do something about it. Edward Flynn is, is neither king nor can afford to build a Taj Mahal in memory of his beloved wives. But he built something better. He built SQUID. S acronym for SQUID is Superconducting Quantum Interference Device. As strange as that name is, this device is out of this world. He brought a mystical and elusive quantum nature of our universe to the benefit of the world of humanity. Edward Flynn is a nuclear physicist at the prestigious Los Alamos Defense Laboratories. He gave a remarkable gift from mother of all sciences, physics, to the field of medicine. A new machine, magnetoencephalograph, was born usually referred as a MEG scanner. This exotic hair blower looking machine is a MAG helmet made up of several squids which are quantum devices that are designed by Edward Flynn's team. This machine without touching the body can read magnetic fields coming from a body that are 100 million times weaker than our Earth's magnetic field. Amanda Momsberg of Wisconsin fell on the kitchen at the age of 8 with a first epileptic seizure. She was getting seizures almost 100 times a day by the age 16. With the help of neuroradiologist Dr. Deepak Raghavan, they made a journey deep into her brain by using MEG scanner without single incision looking for the elusive source of epilepsy. It is just like looking for a needle in the Grand Canyon. It is that difficult. They found the source of her problem hiding deep inside of her brain. No other modality, including powerful MRI, even come close to these findings. The very tiny source of area that is causing her seizures was surgically removed and Amanda is living happily ever after without even a single incident of seizure. This young, this young woman's life was given back by this remarkable machine. The researchers racing towards to find that very tiny number of cells that causing Alzheimer's, schizophrenia, depression, autism, and chronic alcoholism, and many other brain-related diseases. Meg scanner is taking on the most challenging and the deadliest disease of all for women, breast cancer. With the present technologies, you need 10 million cells to be affected before it shows up on any modality or device like a mammography or MRI. But the MEG scanner hunts for those few thousand cells causing cancer out of 90 trillion cells, not a billion, 90 trillion cells. 
probably MEG scanner can detect breast cancer 5 to 10 years in advance before any modality. Vanderbilt, uh, Vanderbilt Gastrointestinal Squid Technology GIST Laboratory is an interdisciplinary initiative by the Department of Surgery and by the Department of Physics to detect, sorry, to detect how to find stomach ailments. Remember, all these things without touching body it is a quantum mystery working through human body. You're not impressed? Okay, hear this. How about reading terrorist minds before even they plan it? How about finding oil and minerals without drilling an inch? How about reading your mind six seconds before even you know it? How about introducing dreams like a DiCaprio movie Inception? Can go on. This is a direct demonstration of quantum physics in action through a medical device while saving countless lives. Nuclear physicist Edward Flynn may not have saved his wife's life but saved countless lives on her memory and will be saving millions in the future. It is a better than a Taj Mahal indeed. Thank you for listening.